Working from home is a great lifestyle, but it's important to establish a healthy work-life balance when working from home as a virtual assistant. It's hard to keep work from creeping in to your personal time and your personal time from creeping in to your work time. Let's explore how you can add structure to your daily routine to prevent that from happening. In this video, I'll provide you with tips to maintain a healthy work-life balance while running your virtual assistant or virtual expert business from home. Defining work-life balance can be different for everyone. You need to be clear on what balance looks like for you so that you can structure your day to meet your expectations. Not having a healthy work-life balance will cause you undue stress and chaos that cancels many of the benefits of creating your own VA business. So how do you create an environment to support this balance in your life? Tip one, get ready for work every day. Just because you're not commuting doesn't mean you shouldn't have a morning ritual. Many of the virtual experts in my group start the day with a morning routine that might include reflective time, exercise, a good breakfast, a shower, and then dress for the day. Once that routine is complete, they're ready to start their work day. There is power in the habit of preparing yourself for work each day. Tip two, create a dedicated workspace for yourself. You may not have a space for a private office, but you can carve out a corner of a room to have a place where you go to every day for work. Some people use their dining room table, a corner of the living room, or a bedroom. I know one virtual expert who set up her office in her bathroom. It was the only space in her house she could find, and she made it work. Tip three, maintain regular office hours. If you were working outside the home, you would have regular hours to be at your job. You also need to establish regular work hours for your VA business. You may find yourself working outside those designated hours occasionally, but that should be the exception, not the rule. Your hours may not be traditional nine to five because you get to decide what's the best fit for you. Tip four, be intentional about taking breaks. It's essential to build in some break time in your day. Take 30 minutes or an hour to make yourself a healthy lunch to fuel your body. You may wanna take some time to get outside and walk around the block. Do something that will energize you and recharge your mind. Don't let your lifestyle become sedentary. Tip five, create an end of day ritual. An exceptional VE will create a routine of reviewing what she has accomplished that day. She'll look forward to future deadlines and time block what will need to be accomplished the following day. This simple practice will prevent you from worrying that you forgot to do something important. After your daily review, celebrate all that you accomplished. Tip six, close the door at the end of your work day. Working from home makes it harder to forget about your work. Leave your office and shut the door. Door. If you do not have a separate office, turn off your computer and walk away. Imagine in your mind closing a door as you leave and don't go back until it's time to work again the next day. Tip seven, plan what you will do after work. Maybe you'll take a brisk walk, play games with your kids, watch a movie. Have something to look forward to at the end of the day will make it easier to stop working. It will help you decompress and recharge for the next day. Many women are attracted to the virtual assistant or virtual expert career path because they get to work from home. However, it can be challenging to separate yourself from work when your work is always nearby. It takes intention to structure your day to keep work and life in balance. Being proactive rather than reactive is key to helping you maintain that balance. If you would like to learn more about how to find, get, and keep high paying clients for your virtual expert business, Sign up for my five-day training, Create a Virtual Career in the New Economy. All you need to do is click the link below. Also, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on that little bell to be notified when I upload a new video. And then if you would take just a moment to like this video and give me a comment, let me know what you thought.